Straight up means a new beginning for me because I came into this program thinking that I could not do it because I am a woman. But now seeing the trade that I want to do, which is elevator construction, I know now that I can do it and I can do more and I'm ready to continue on in my path in my career. Trade Up has opened up doors for me that I didn't know were out there as far as getting into the trades and learning about them and getting a chance to put get some hands-on experience that I, I vitally needed to help me trans transition into the trade of my choice. My favorite trade was actually the cement and plasters. About half first and then after we pour the cement in and let it mix a little bit, then we add more as needed. I'm a girly girl, so they just didn't believe that I would enjoy getting my hands dirty and tying my hair up and I came home so dirty, but the whole experience was amazing because I actually have a finished product that I could see and it's something that I did and I made and it was mine and I enjoyed doing it and I did it with the rest of my team and we had a good time. Walking into City Hall, I thought it was going to be a regular, ordinary day. We, we came today because we wanted you to know that people are ready to work and eager. And again, this is just these 10. We have 104 of them already. But after hearing Miss Scott speak, I realized that it was an extraordinary day. When she was up there talking, I realized that she was not just talking to me. I realized she was talking to us black people, our young generation. So we don't want it where it's too wet. Because it's too wet, what happened is set long, take long to set. And also the crack on it. Because what happened is when you add a lot of water to it, it takes away the cement. The cement wouldn't have the strength in it. So when you start taking, when you start taking away, it's not getting weaker. Weaker, 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 weaker. The trainers here have all, have all been excellent and worked with us, and they've shown me that it is something that I can do. I've always seen construction as, as something that was out of reach, but with the trainers here, with their training, with their understanding and helping us, I see that it is something that is doable, that I can accomplish, and, and it is something that can be in sight for me. Throughout all the trades we visited, the they stressed being on time. They're looking at their best people. You're looking at people that are dependable. You're looking at people that can get there on time. You're supposed to be there at 6.30 and you get there at 6.25, you're already late. You need to be there at 6 o'clock so that you can get to where you need to be on time. I love to get out of bed to come to be with my friends and my family here. And it won't stop. Ooh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> I feel like I'm being groomed for something great to happen in my life. I was pulled aside by uh, Ms. Faircloth, who told me that in a leadership role, you must ha be able to follow as well as be able to lead. We've helped each other out in the field, working together, building projects together, and um, it's been a wonderful experience. And eight sisters that I did not have, that we have went through things together and we have become a family. When I met her for the first time, um, when she walked into the room, her grace just uh, it kind of hits you in the face and she just um, pretty much came on as very, being very approachable. So I feel that I have a, a big sister that, or a mentor that I can always count on and in the time of need or when I just need to talk, She's actually been better than my family has been to me. And I would love to pattern myself after Miss Scott. Who are we? Trade up! Who are we? Trade up! Who are we? Trade up! Rigging skills? Trade up! Signing skills? Trade up! For safety door? Trade up! Who are we? 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 Trade up! Who